Hello, I'm going to show you how you can take something from Think Central and put it into a Google Jamboard and then you can write in it. Um, here we go. So if we're in Think Central over here and I click on the student edition ebook and we have a table of contents so you can go um, anywhere you want. I'm in chapter eight, but let's go to chapter one, chapter one, lesson three, and we see we have uh, the student workbook pages. So over here is this new thing called Google Jamboard. And if you go to the waffle, which my video is covering, here we go, go to the waffle and click on Jamboard. What I'm finding is that it's very similar to um, Seesaw, the Seesaw application. So we're going to hit New Jam. And I'm going to go back over here and I have a screenshot tool. So mine looks like this feather. Take a screenshot, which if you don't have a screenshot tool, you can go to the uh, app, Google App Play Store and get one, okay, just as an extension. So I have a screenshot saved, and then I'm gonna go to my Jamboard and not right click, but I'm gonna hit uh, Control V to paste it. And there it is, it does take a second to load. So what I think is gonna happen is I'm gonna, t this page is going into a Jamboard. Yep, and I must have hit it four times because there it is four times. So I'm going to delete three of them and I can move it up here. Now Jamboard looks better uh, landscape. I don't know if I can change that. Nope. Okay. That's a sticky note. But if you want to do it, you could have, we could have taken like a half page snip like that. Okay. And then that would fill the screen up more. Don't need that. So here we are in Jamboard and then um, you can write on it using a pen here. How many visitors were there in July of 2008? Uh, six, five, one. Now I'm using a mouse. I, this is not my favorite way to teach math, but um, there it is. You may be able to also do to type how many visitors were there in July of 2008. In July of 2008, there were 665 comma 188. So to me, that's better, right? You can share this um, with your students and this is a Google G Suite app. Um, so then you can um, post it on Google Classroom, but I've heard teachers, it just came out and they're starting to have a lot of fun with this Jamboard and using it uh, to teach the math lessons. So I hope that helps, I hope that answers your question um, and reach out if you have anything else.